We begin this afternoon with a developing story. A cold case cracked 30 years later. Tony Hayes of Wyoiga has been charged in a double homicide from March 21st, 1992. Timothy Mumbrew and Tana Togstad were found stabbed to death inside Tana's apartment in Wapaka County. A dog was also found stabbed to death. The state says recent DNA testing led to Hayes's arrest. Well, investigators say they have continually looked at leads into this case and continue to collect DNA from people of interest. That would eventually lead them to Hayes. Investigators showed up to his work yesterday at the Wapaka Foundry and brought him to the sheriff's office for questioning. Hayes reportedly denied having anything to do with the killings, but told investigators he had, quote, memories, and that made him scared. Court documents say his dad died when he was seven years old during a snowmobile race with three others. One of the other men racing was Tana Togstad's father. He said on the night of March 20th, 1992, he got very drunk. He told investigators he started thinking about that deadly accident, and that led him to Togstad's home. Court documents show he could not explain why he was there, but insisted it was not to hurt anyone. He got into a, quote, scuffle with Mumbrew at the apartment. That's when Hayes told investigators he stabbed Mumbrew. He then said he punched Tongstad in the face and stabbed her. Hayes told investigators he has no idea why he did it. Tana's brother was in court today. I don't know how the investigation went. I don't know. Uh, I do know that uh, Wapaka County has worked very hard. DCI has worked very hard, the FBI, and uh, I don't know who else, but a lot. Hayes faces two counts of first degree intentional homicide. If convicted, he faces life in prison. Well, if you know anything about the case that could help investigators, the state would like to talk to you. That number on your screen right now, 1-855-237-3262.